Mm, the things I could do with you. <laughs> oh, God damn it. Yes, I'm coming, I'm coming. All right, get in here. Welcome, welcome, you legends, legends and larrikins, to another episode of the Wild Winter Homestead. Yes, today is going to be a very interesting one. I hope you've got your warm clothes on, and I hope... Your nipples are erect because we've got to go hiking. We've got to go all the way back down to the shop and uh, pick up the F truck. And uh, that means we've got to hike through the woods, ladies and gentlemen. So grab your coats and let's get moving. All right. Are you ready? Good. That's what I like to hear. Let's ride. We'll go out this door. We'll go the shortest way possible. I just grabbed the barbecue. I must have the lumberjack thing on. There we go. Uh, excuse me. Thank you. Close the door. Let's get out of here, subbies. All right. Welcome to all the new subscribers. Uh, I think six of you since the last time I recorded. And uh, that's awesome. It's always cool to have new faces aboard. New larrikins. Yes. And... Uh, for those who don't know, we are trialling Miles' idea of a firewood uh, processor. And that's what this, the main chunk of this episode is going to be today, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> now, it's freezing out here, so cuddle up if you're cold, alright? Now, we're going to walk down to the shop. It's not too far. Maybe we can hitch a ride near the road, but... Uh, yeah, oh, look at that view. Isn't it beautiful? So yes, today's all about cutting firewood. Now, I've set up the processor. There's wood and lumber ready to go. Yes! Yes, indeed. And, uh, yeah, we're going to try and earn some money today. That's going to be the problem. Now, do you think... One day I'm going to own these fields, but do you think they'll have an issue with me just walking through? I know I'm going to get soaked. That's all right. We're just going to walk through. You know, if anyone comes and starts shooting at us... You guys stand up and sacrifice yourselves so I can get away, please. And we'll use the excuse that we're uh, chasing the crows out of his field. Uh, all right, we've got to get to this bridge because uh, I don't think there's another way to cross that river or creek or whatever it is. Or creek, as you Yankees would call it. Our Yankee brethren. And, uh, yeah, look, here we are. We're, we're almost there already. Look, it doesn't take that long. And it gives us a chance to hold hands and walk in the snow together and sing. All right? But, uh, yeah, thanks for watching the last episode. Uh, it was a bit of a trial, shall we say. Now, at the time of recording this, I have only just released that episode. So I haven't seen... Uh, any comments about what it's going to be, how much we could earn. Fucking hell, was that... Hey! I thought he swerved at us then. Um, I haven't seen any comments about how much we could get paid from the local government to clear this snow from all around the map. And it would be worth our time to do. I would hope so anyway, because we've hired that tractor and it wasn't cheap. Alright, so, and, yeah, hopefully, and the snow plough too, so, hopefully we can make a little bit of money uh, out of it. Man, it is deep. It is deep. Someone let their corn go to bloody, go to seed. Um, but yeah, so this episode's going to be all about that. Now, let's jog to get some warmth up. You ready? Come on. Keep up. You larrikins, my God. You're like me. You're getting fat and slow. Ugh. That's all right. I've got some joints here in my pocket we can partake. Yes. And uh, that'll get you going. Actually, it'll make us super lazy and chill and give us the munchies. But... We'll be okay. Not far near, not far near. Let's make sure we're not going to get hit. Yeah, keep your eyes peeled. Let's get across this bridge. Beautiful. All right. 
Alright, let's cross the highway. Keep your eyes peeled for cars, chat. Oh, shit! There's one coming. Move. Now, should we stop into the survey for a bloody hand job and a uh, meat pie? Nah, nah, we'll, we'll be right. We'll be right. Alright. Let's keep going. Here's the truck. There it is. Ugh. Now, it's still the same day, so... Ugh. Should be warm. It, it is almost getting night time, but I want to get at least a load done before we go to bed tonight. That's the goal. Um, we may not drop it into town till the morning, but at least if we can get the tub of this filled up with some logs, with some firewood, we'll be right. And we've got to bring it all the way back down here into town. That's fine. Oh, look for cars. Alright, we're fine. Let's ride. Guess we better turn the lights on so we don't get pulled over by the police, man! Oh. Whoa! Second gear. There we go. I missed the gears there for a second. Oh, shit! Whoa! That's why you should look where you're going, ladies and gentlemen. And probably not drink and drive. Not advisable. Unless you're on private property, and then you go right ahead. Drink and drive to your heart's content. Hell yeah, I know I do. My god. Alright. Pick up the pace, get back up the hill as quick as we can. Uh, yeah. What was I saying? I don't know. But thank you to everyone who is watching and commenting. Much appreciated. Uh... And, uh, yeah, I'm... I'll have a look when I'm finished recording this and see how that episode's going. Been doing pretty well. i you know, much better than I thought I ever would on the old spew tube. Right. Uh... Just doing this for a bit of a laugh and a bit of fun. So, join us, won't you? And subscribe, yes! Become a subby today! Let's get up here. Alright. Man, I love this old rig. I would actually kill for one of these. Um, F-250 High Boys. What the? Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but High Boy wasn't actually... Look at the snow already coming back. Bloody hell. Um, High Boy wasn't actually a released thing from Ford, was it? It was... Uh custom thing I believe for like forestry something like that so I believe that actual high boys are pretty rare so but correct me if I'm wrong out there Americans but you guys have easily easily the best um, vehicles well the old ones anyway I don't know about the new ones but like these old American trucks man holy crap they just Man, they wet my whistle. Let's say that, all right? <laughs> yes. And I would love one in real life. You know, I like my Fords. Now, where I live over here, we have race um, between uh, one, oh here in this well, a town, my closest town's about forty minutes from where I live. A place called Bathurst, and it has. Uh, an annual race between Ford and Holden. That's right. Oh, and Or GM. You would probably know it better as. But Holden was like the Australian branch of GM. And, uh, yeah, every year the V8s, they race down there. But now Holden's gone. We only have Fords. And now there's all these European and Japanese shitty bloody brands in there. And it's kind of ruined. But back in the day, it used to be just Ford versus Holden. And that was cool. And, uh... Yeah, I've never really been a big car race supporter, but... The, uh... Burning rubbers in my blood, shall we say. Yes! I love it. I love the cheech. These old vehicles, man. There ain't nothing modern that compares. And here we are. Look at this! Well, the snow's already back, so we're gonna have to do some more clearing. And it's literally the same day, and this is what I was worried about. It's snowing so hard that doing anything is 
like a major undertaking. Um, and look, it's getting late too, so... Alright, we got here in time, but let's see if we can't at least give this thing a test and see how it's going to go. Um, we'll kill the motor. Turn the lights off so we don't kill the battery. Alright, let's go. Now, to work this thing. Uh, we'll start this so we can put some lights on. There we go. Now, to work this, you got to hop in it. Alright. <laughs> and uh, start the engine. Now, I'll put the buttons up here. I did a little bit of um, control work to sort of get this on my keyboard so it's all controlled with my right hand instead of left as you would normally move around and stuff like that. So, let's see here. Um, we've got to go. How do we load? Okay, it is this. Let's give it a go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's Our first log. Our first firewood. Yes, here we go. Miles, this one's for you, brother. Now, how do we move the... Um, oh, here we go. So I've got to hold, right shift, and down. Whoa, wrong way. Okay, there we go. Beautiful. And then we cut. Uh, do we want six pieces? Let's work out what we want. Two pieces, four. Let's go four pieces. That's probably the best. That's how I split mine anyway, unless they're really big rounds. Um, and then we go right control to cut. And then, let me get you a better angle here. Not that you can see because it's midnight. Now, these are a bit small, so we better go like this, I'd say. Alright, there we go. And then we go... How do I do it? Alt. Bang! And that's it. Oh, we only got one out of that, but that's alright. So, and let's do it again. We go shift. Bang. Uh, control. Alt. Uh, whoop. Bang. Control. Alt. Now, why isn't the... Uh, thing working? The conveyor belt. And where's all the wood going? Is this... This log might be too skinny. I can't see shit either, so... This might be a morning job. Um, start unloading belt. Oh, so I have to do that too. Okay. Right shift. There we go. Okay, so it's a bit of a, like, trick. So we go... Bang, no. Bang. 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 Go. Let's see if we can get good at this. Yes! Okay, yeah, so the log's too small now, so... Okay, so we need bigger logs. Yeah, look at that. Okay. But this is a couple of test pieces. Let's have a look in the back of the Ford, see how it's going. Beautiful! Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. We have firewood! Now! Can I pick up that piece? I can. Sweet. All right. That's awesome. Okay, I have used this mod before, but it's been... It's been a while since... Where did that piece go? Since, uh... When Farming Sim first came in... Oh, when this mod first came out, which I don't think was long after... Um... FS22 came out. It was an early mod. All right. Beautiful. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. I guess... Let's keep going for the evening. Uh, push these logs forward. Now, we're probably going to need bigger logs, I'd say, uh, to do this. Alright, there's that. Now, we've got to stand on the controls here. Alright. I apologise for the darkness. Oh, no, wrong one. I need the HUD for this until I get used to it. I need, uh, what is it? 
Uh, shift and L for load. That's why I did that. I remember now. Okay, so... Oh! Oh! Boom. Okay, it can load fairly long pieces. Good to know. Good to know. Now, this... Alright. Boom. Then we go control. Alt. Yeah, look at that. It just disappears. God damn it. Okay, so you need big... Or maybe I've got the setting wrong. Cut diameter. How do I change the diameter? Ah. Okay. Hmm. Does this thing have lights? No, it doesn't. It looks like it's got lights up the top there, but... Um... Wait a second. Yes, it does! Hey! We got lights, ladies and gentlemen! I'm not stupid, I promise! Yes, I am! <laughs> oh, dear. Alright. Bloody hell. Yeah, see? Look at that. What a shame. What a shame. I was hoping that this would, uh... Bugger. So you've got to use fairly big pieces. Unless... What if I split it into two? That might be an issue too. They're not... Um, let's try that. They're yeah, just experimenting, alright? No, don't panic. We've got plenty. We've got plenty of timber, alright? Let's try six pieces. Boom! Boom! Yeah, okay, now nah, they're just too small. That's alright. That's alright, no dramas. Um... Hmm. Well, it's not worth doing that one that's on the ground there now, honestly. Let's just cut this one up. Back to... Let's get the practice of the flow, anyway. Um. Bang! Bang. Okay. We didn't get much out of that. And we're not going to get much out of this one, too. Can I pick it up? Can. It's pretty light. So that's the issue. These are just not um, doable. What I can do, actually, is just say... Because I can pick these up. Let's just do that. So it's not wasting timber. Now, I don't know if it's going to be able to sell because I've done it this way. But I guess we'll find out. Now, the reason I cut this over here is because of the wood chip. If you're wondering, like, why did you do it over there? The wood chip's a pain in the ass. I know I can turn it off, but it makes... It's more realistic with it on, so I'm leaving it on. Alright, let's go look for a bigger log. Come on! Then we're going to have to do some more clearing. Some snow clearing, I think. There's no point in to... Actually, there's no point in doing that until it uh, gets to the next level. Alright, now what do we got here? These are bigger ones, so... Let's go for this one. <laughs> oh no! Come on! Far out, man. Yeah! Alright, we did it. We got that. We got that. Come on. Come on. Down. Grab. Lift. Can we get this out? Is it too... No, it's way too heavy. Right. <clears throat> Grab the saw. Boom. Okay, this log will do better. I know it. Now, can I... Hit that road. 
Yes! Beautiful. Alright. Oh shit, I didn't see that tree. It's getting too dark. It's getting too dark, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go into first person. There we go. That's better. So yeah, we've got some good logs there we can use. If I stop fucking running into shit because I'm a dumbass. Yeah. <laughs> oh. This is no, man. I am struggling. Alright. I thought I was going to hit that tree then. Alright, there we go. I can actually see where I'm going. But yeah, the snow is getting proper deep. So. <laughs> That's alright. Let's get this on here. Um, what I should do too is clear the road so I can line that up properly. So here we go. Come on. Yes, you mighty Kubota. Alright. Done. Now let's get this on here. Oh, shit! Alright, bang. Nope, wrong way. Move back. Uh, put that down. Let's try again. Now. Uh, it was. Load. There we go. L for load. Bloody hell. We are not having much luck, ladies and gentlemen. What if we... What if we just load it in ourselves? So I don't want to oh, far out. Okay. Bang. Now if I get around the back of it. Let's go. Let's go. Through the snow. Oh! I should make... Whoa, shit. I really should just do a lot of clearing. But I'm lazy, alright? Let's get this... Here. And... Up. Uh, why can't I... There we go. <laughs> oh, dear. And up you go. Come on. Up you go. Come on. Yeah! Oh, shit. Okay. This... You know. This firewood thing... Is turning into a lot more work. But if it's... You know what? If I get good money for it... It'll be worth it. Alright? So we'll... We'll wait and see. We'll wait and see. I haven't looked at prices or anything. Alright, let's hop in the machine. Boom. Whoops, and he's going. Let's see how this one goes. Why does it get rid of half of it? What am I doing wrong? I, I know I'm doing something wrong. Like, is it this? Let's put it way up. See if that makes a difference. I don't know. I don't know, like Whoops, that's the wrong button. That's a pretty dangerous button. Uh, it's right next to the Windows key, so... It's just not a super efficient way of making money, this, is it? Let's try and make it smaller. We'll go six-piece, and let's 
Whoops, that's the wrong button. Down again. Try this. And if I'm doing something wrong, I'm pretty sure you're yelling at your screen. Like, you idiot, you know? And that's fine. But yeah, it's weird how it's just sort of deleting half of the log like that. Oops. Keep hitting the wrong button. We're getting there. Look, we got firewood happening, you know? It's happening, ladies and gentlemen. But yeah, I just can't understand why half the log disappears. See, it says current diameter is zero. But I think that's... Let's get that down. Hmm... I don't think the length has had anything to do with it. It's got to be that, right? What about this middle button? Does it do anything? No. It's a splitting diameter. I got no idea. I don't know. I don't understand why it's doing that. All right. Never mind. Let's just keep going. I want to load. Oh, shit. I just saw the back of the F truck. Have a look. <laughs> oh. Oh, uh, yeah. Awesome. Come on. Yes, there you go. Oh, shit! I just chucked that into the stratosphere. I think I need to lift the uh, conveyor belt up a bit. Let's do that now. Okay. Beautiful. I think the snow is actually moving the thing, too. Let's adjust the truck. I'm pretty sure the snow is moving the... <laughs> moving the thing. There we go. There we go. Let's go forward a little bit. Beautiful. Alright, can we get one more log? What about you? Can I lift you? I can. You're probably too... Uh... Like, let's just fucking... Cut you up here. Oh, I would. They can split it. Who cares? Alright. Oh, okay. Yep. <laughs> uh, right. Duck. Oh, wash your head. Now, see if we can't find another big... Thing. It'll be interesting to see the price, shall we say, because if we get more money than we would just for logs, it'll be worth it. Uh, let's get these. See, they're all small. I left a sort of tops of the trees. We need the big boys. Huh? See, all of that's just crap. And that's why I thought the firewood thing would be such, uh, like an actually great idea, because we'd be able to get rid of the tops of the trees. Oh, shit! But it's not working out that way so far. No, no, sir. All right. Come on. Bang. Down. Grab it. 
Yes, there you go. Okay. Out you go. See, this is a good piece. Should get a, a good bit out of this. Now, what I'm going to try this time is just loading it straight up and into the machine instead of putting it on the ground for the loader to do. And I can't steer. Come on! This may have been too heavy a piece. Come on! Come on! There we go. Turn! No! <laughs> Damn it. Come on! Go! Yes! This fucking snow, man. Holy shit. I think in the morning, we'll have to do some more clearing. Just gotta happen, because this is ridiculous. Can I reach that? Can I reach? Come on, Kubota, you can do it, you mighty machine. Go, release. I don't think I can quite reach it. No! Fuck. <laughs> uh, I'm stuck. Well. Yeah! Don't worry, everyone. It's a hired machine. It doesn't matter if it gets wrecked. Right? <laughs> and I just realised I moved the machine, too. Get that under there. See, the log, the forks might be a better idea for this. But this is, so far, holy shit, man. It's just too difficult for the machinery I've got. I can understand, like, when I'm better off and I've got bigger machines, but this is just a fucking nightmare. Because I'm trying not to cheat, because i got the Lumberjack mod, I could easily cheat and put this on myself. But I'm trying not to do that, because I want this to be like a hardcore playthrough where it's, you know, because you physically, in real life, could not lift this log. Ah, oh, fuck me. And now I know what you're thinking. Cut them smaller, dickhead. And that's what I'm thinking too. But I just wanted to try not to double handle shit, so... Here we go. So basically, we have to cut smaller. It's just the way she goes. So perhaps the process will be... You know, cut them to size, bring them over. And then how are we going to dump them in? We're going to need a ramp or something move the F truck again all right all right beautiful 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 let's go we can do this yes now hopefully the log doesn't half disappear on us because this is a big round Boom. And it does. So there's something wrong there. I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong. Maybe the... It's just not big enough. Maybe you just need massive rounds. I don't know. Look at that. We can get this going, though, like... How are we looking? We've got a full load. Oh, 
Oh, I'd say we do. <laughs> All right, let's kill the lights, kill the engine. We're gonna need to do some clear. Let's get this out of here first. We're gonna need to do some clearing. Tomorrow. But soon we're gonna rug up into bed nice and warm. Yes. Yeah, this snow is fucking wild. All right. Ah! Ah. You can stay here then, Kubota. We'll get you out in the morning. <laughs> Let's push those forward. Perfect. Look at that. I'd say that's a load, ladies and gentlemen, wouldn't you? Hey. Alright, let's back on down to the house. Straps on. Get inside and get warm. Yes. Alright, come inside, chat. Come inside, that's it. Yeah, close the door. Keep the heat in. Bang. Yeah. You guys can sleep on the couch. Help yourselves to whatever you need. I'm going for a wank and a sleep. Bang. Fan bloody tastic. All right, we got there. Man, that was frustrating. Holy shit. Um. Yeah, look at that. We've lost a lot of money, and it's mainly due to leasing and the production costs. I just don't think this is going to be a viable thing. We'll we'll find out in a minute though. We've spent a lot of money. <laughs> a lot of money on this. All right, let's go down and deliver some firewood, ladies and gentlemen, shall we? Yes, put the cab lights on. Fire up this old girl. Awesome. When we get back, we'll probably have to do some clearing before we start the day. And it's still snowing, too. Man. Now, the bonus of doing the firewood... I can see, is that we can deliver it with the ute. Um, and that, yeah. Hmm. I got an idea, so... Let's get down there, and we'll see how much this is worth. And we've got to deliver to, uh... Let's actually have a look for some names on here. Uh, not this. What am I doing? Well. Try and find out some subscribers' names here. Let's have a look. Got more. Miles is obviously um, staying with the firewood processor and giving the Kubota a good shining. Um, who we got? To have a look. Oh, Miles has been commenting. I will get back to you in a moment. Good sir, good sir. Yes. Uh, I can't actually see any names. Okay. Who we got here? Alright, Chris Kingsley. We gotta deliver some firewood to Chris Kingsley in town. Or if he lives, if he's an out of towner like me, then someone in his family. They need this firewood. Isn't that right, Chris? Hell yeah, brother. All right. Down the hill before this snow gets out of control again. Look at how deep it is. Man. That's got to be like the maximum, I think. I have, because, yeah, the road filled up again, but the sides didn't seem to get too much deeper. So we must be at like max snow level, I would say. It's alright. It's good. 
And what day are we in? We're in week three of January, so... I'll leave that on for you guys, actually. I don't know which you like better. Do you like it better with the... hard on or off? You tell me. So write it down there in the comments. Now! Do it now! Or else I'll spank you, boy. That's right. You get a good spanking. My God. All right. Let's go. Oh, shit. Should definitely watch where I'm going. I'm glad that the tub works really well on this. I know some mods, the tub doesn't work. Shit just falls through it. But this, yeah, it does. It works good. Again, this is my favourite mod on this game. Besides everything that Squiggles makes. I love this bloody F truck. Alright. Let's go. Let's get on down to Chris's place and... Get this wood delivered! Yes! <laughs> Pick up the energy a bit. Come on! Maybe I should start singing again. Hmm. What song? Uh... Oh yeah, yeah! Stella Stein with the Callous Mill! My dog just freaked out. <laughs> I'm sorry, boy. Sit. You're okay. <laughs> down, boy. Down, boy. Right, <laughs> sorry, boy. I oh, know. I'm an idiot. Good boy. Now, oh, that's what I should say. I'm going to do a video, and you let me know what you think. I'm thinking of doing a week... Uh, a life in the... In the week... Uh, what is it? Oh. Um, my brain just full-on had a moment. Um, a life... Oh, man, how do I say that? A week in the life of a bogan. There we go. God, we got there eventually. Man! I must be having a stroke or something. God damn. A week in the life of a bogan. Yes! Yes! <laughs> ah! Where it's... Um, yeah, I'll show you what I do in a week in real life okay here we are this is Chris's place now let's not block traffic now he wants it there beside the garage so he can unload alright so let's drive in alright here you go Chris mate we got a load for you let's see how much you're gonna pay us for jeez you got a lot of shit out the back here mate uh, all right, let's uh, let's knock. Let him know. Hello, Chris. We're here. All right, very good. We got some firewood for you, my friend. Let's have a look. How much are you going to pay us for? Whoa, that was actually not too bad. What a couple of logs. What do you mean you got something for sale that'd be better than this? Really? This old thing? Really? If I can get it going, it's free, you reckon? Hmm. Okay. Well, yes. This would be perfect for firewood runs. Huh. Let's get in and have a look. Ugh, what am I doing? What am I doing? I keep pressing the mouse wheel. Stop it! Stop it! <laughs> Alright, we're in. Oh man, this is tidy. This is tidy! Are you sure? Chris. You devil. We'll take it. We've got to get it going though. It is completely stuffed. Yep. Completely banged up. We'll look at that. Hmm. Next episode. Next episode. We might have a firewood truck. Alright. Cheers for that, mate. Yep, don't sell it out from under me. We'll be back for that. For sure. Alright. 
Oh, wait till Miles hears about this. <laughs> An actual firewood truck. Hell yeah, brother. All right, let's go cut another load. Oh, shit. And try not to drive into the ditch. Man. That old International would be a perfect firewood truck. Big uh, dump bed on it. We could just dump it off to the customer and go. Don't have to unload. Stack it. Hmm. Perfect. Yes. Alright. Let's go cut another load and, uh... Yeah. Interesting, interesting. Hmm. Free if we can get it going. Well, that's what I like to hear, ladies and gentlemen. What do you think? Free if we can get it going? Hell yeah! <laughs> Whoa, shit! Hang on! Yeah. There's no seatbelts in this old rig. It's just an old hockey strap, so... Make sure you got your hockey strap on. <laughs> Alright. Well. What was it? 1200 bucks? Wasn't too bad. If we can get, like, a good process going. That'll be fine. Yes. We're going to get into the firewood business, ladies and gentlemen. Hmm. We need to, like clear the snow proper though I think that's what we're gonna do now we need more room to move we need to be able to get access to the uh to the wood we can always cut some more trees we've got plenty of timber so that might be the plan yes all right Ugh. Get around. Now, how's this rig looking? We're going to have to service it soon. Oh, man. We're going to have to do another run down the hill with the... Uh, tractor, too. Clear it out a bit. All right. Get up. Come on! Now, the rooster is crowing out there again, as he does. So I apologise for that. Live on a farm. That's just life. Not much I can do about it. Actually, there's nothing I can do about it unless I kill him. Which I have thought about doing. Don't worry about that. He likes sitting right under my window, the little bastard. Singing his lungs out. Get in here. Get this truck uh, out of the way. Because what have we got? Actually, let's have a look what we've got left. Because we don't want these skinny, shitty logs. We want the bigger ones. And these are all just crap. And we could probably save this for spring when the snow melts and then just cut these up by hand firewood uh, and not worry about splitting it in the machine so let's uh, we may cut some more timber Whoop. turn the lights off yeah all right let's jump in the old forward see if she starts it is cold Put your face right over that pipe there. And tell me... Look down there. You tell me if it's... Oh! <laughs> face full of soot. Hell yeah. All right. Give it a rev. Oh, said a rev. Yes. Beautiful. All right. Time to get this snow machine working. Boom. Now, how do I... Oh. Okay. Go! 
Yes, yes! <laughs> Let's do some proper clearing, ladies and gentlemen. I know it's the, the most entertaining thing in the world, but it's got to be done, unfortunately. Because I can no longer abide just bouncing around this, uh, in the thing. And there's actually a good log right there, so we'll do that. Immediately hit the tree, and then go. You know, all right. And there's a good log just here too, so let's clear this so we can get to it. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, back we go. Do that again. swing the Kubota around and grab that one for sure and then yeah the rest we're just gonna have to cut up by hand which is fine it's gonna take a bit longer but yeah we've got logs and shit everywhere so off camera I might do a bit of a cleanup um, you can see I've got a log I'm pushing a log right now yeah, there's just so much trapped under the snow. I didn't do a very efficient job of cleaning up. <laughs> uh, cleaning up from the logging we did. That's alright. It's alright, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Now, I do want to work out a ramp of some kind. How are we going to build a ramp? Let's get around here. Okay. Chuck a Yui. Boom. Look at the plants. Man, they look sassy. That's our fortune there, ladies and gentlemen. Firewood, logging, and everything else aside. That's what I really want in life, is to be the weed king of the region. Yes. Now, uh, I think it was Miles, too, who asked, uh, is there... Or it would be awesome to have an actual field crop of weed. And I know they used to do that. I know in 19 there was. Uh, and I'm pretty sure in the map Land Down Under, which is a 16 times map, it's, it's bloody awesome. Um, if you go back and watch some really old videos of mine, we did when I was just first starting the YouTube, um, me and my mate steered a uh, thing called the 20 to 8 contracting. Um, and yeah, it was a bit of a laugh where we just played some multiplayer and had a like contracting business. But yeah, it was early on in the piece, so it's rough and ready. It's rough all right, but it was good fun. So if you're interested, go back in the channel and have a look at those. Now, I don't know exactly what I'm doing here, but we're just sort of generally clearing the area. Especially, I want to clean up around here. What I'd like to do, you know, is get a winch. But they're bloody expensive. They're like 14 grand. I know I've got one that can go onto a gooseneck for about five grand. Which would be the go. Hmm. Just thinking out loud. But, uh, yeah. Because all this stuff here, it's not worth our time doing this little shit in the machine. We need bigger 
uh, logs. So what I think I'm going to do is cut down these trees here between the house and here. So we can got this bit cleared through here. All right. I think that's what we're going to do. Although I do like having the trees there. But we might plant something else instead. What about over here, close to the actual thing? Because we could work in here. Maybe clear... Like, definitely this big one. We could drop that right here next to the machine. And do that. Let's say... Yeah, let's, let's do that. Come on. There we go. We're going to clear out these few right here next to the machine. That might make the process a bit quicker. Now, as for a ramp, what are we going to do about that, ladies and gentlemen? Hmm. Hmm. Let's jump in the cab and grab out the phone and have a look on the internet. Quick, put your hand in there. There's a jam. Put your hand in there, I said. Come on. All right. All right. Let's have a look at the phone. Just turn the, that off for a sec. Now, every minute we use this is costing us money. So, let's not dawdle. Uh, what am I doing? This is the wrong one. We need this menu. Okay. Let's have a look. Okay. No items. Ramps. How much is a ramp going to cost us, ladies and gentlemen? Um... And where would it be? It'd be in tools. All right, let's have a look here. We've got these. A thousand bucks, that's all right. We could do that. We could do that now, actually. That might be a decent investment. This is what I really want. I want this shed, too. Look at that. Love to have this shed up here. Um, And it's pretty cheap. So what else have we got? We've got another thousand dollar ramp here. Let's have a look at what these ramps are. So we've got this ramp. That's pretty good because it's got a stopper on the end of it. Um, and that's it. Okay, so we've got that ramp. And then these ones are good, but you can see these are like a... You use these to build a platform. You know, which will be handy in the future. But I think we go for that one with the stopper. It's only a thousand bucks too. See, these ones here are good, but they're beyond our price range. Look at that one. So, just something small like this. You know? I think that's going to be the go. We've got to pour the concrete and do all that, which is going to be near impossible in this, but let's clear an area and See how we go. Right, get this back on. Let's hit the road. Now, how long have we been recording for? Oh shit, the hour's almost up. So, let's just clear this up and we'll put the ramp down. And that'll be the episode, ladies and gentlemen. Yes! <laughs> a bit of a slow one this time. That's alright. You know, not every episode can be... Breakneck speed! No. And where are we going to put this ramp? I think it should be on the side where we're going to dump these trees. So over here. Alright, let's turn that base into the forest. Alright. I'm thinking over here. We can load it in. Let's push this Kubota. It needs a helping hand. Okay. Hopefully we can get it out. I'm thinking right here, ladies and gentlemen. Right in front of us there would be a good place for the ramp. So then we would have to clear a path. We can drop these trees close by. Look at the stump on that. Yes. 
Yes, indeed. All right. I don't mind going over the hour mark, that's fine a bit. But yeah, like I was saying, and I know I just read Miles' comment there on my phone, and I will reply to you in a second, mate, I'm just recording. But I'll reply to you on here, actually. You said that you would watch it if it was five hours long there. That's fantastic. I appreciate that, brother. But, uh, yeah, looking at the anal Y ticks, all right, the anal Y ticks, it's... By the half hour mark, everyone's gone. And that's cool. That's fine. Everyone's got their own life. But God damn you! Watch till it! Nah, I'm just joking. It's fine. But, uh, yeah. So I'm making an hour long, you know? And... I'm gonna... Th Look. I'm not gonna live stream on Twitch. Anymore. Twitch can go fuck itself. As far as I'm concerned. Um, it's just a terrible platform nowadays. And, yeah, so if I'm going to stream, it'll be on Kick or YouTube. But YouTube, I'm going to save for 500. If we, get, if we can get to the 500 subbies, all right, you betcha, I'll do live streams. But uh, just at the moment, you know, just recording like this is, is the way to go for me. Alright, beautiful. And I think the ramp will go right here. And we can move the thing back. The uh, processor. Alright, let's kill that. Ugh. And put this ramp down, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, subbies, grab the concrete. Grab the, um, what are they called? Um... Oh god, I've had another brain fart. Um, what you put down for concreting? Oh shit, that's a big ramp when you see it like that. What do you reckon, right? So we're spending a thousand bucks, but that's fine, that's fine. Let's go closer to the road, like... Bang. Good work, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, that will do nicely. Now we can drop these trees that I'm peeing on. And, uh, and yeah, load it from this thing, from this ramp. Look at that. Beautiful. All right. And that'll do it there, ladies and gentlemen. We'll see you in the next one. Uh, yeah, I'll be doing more firewood, basically, probably for a couple of episodes. We need to make some goddamn money, all right? Arthur, we need to make some goddamn money. And we'll see you then in the next episode. Cheers, guys.